when we're first working with the lead here at Yeti, somebody usually comes with a question about how long is it going to take to build my app, uh, depending on where they are at in the process and defining their, their app ID and their project, the ability to estimate how long uh, an app might take to create is quite difficult. And there's a lot of variables that go into it. It's usually fairly unique for whatever the specific situation is. Uh, generally though, we subscribe to trying to build a first version of your app quickly at a lower cost so that you can get it out in front of users. You can do user testing. You can start to see, are you building uh, the right thing for the right people and start to gauge your success or hopefully fail quickly. So we, in a, in a first engagement building something from scratch, don't like to spend more than three months really building the first version of something. Of course, there's certain circumstances where uh, it's gonna take longer than three months to build the first version of an app, especially if it has some sort of complicated use case or technologies or something that's really on maybe the cutting edge of uh, some, some new technology. But if you're building a mobile app or a web app, I would recommend and, and generally that you spend one to three months uh, developing the first version of your app and try to st stick to a, what is the uh, minimum lovable product that you can really get out where you could actually have people start to use it, um, get value out of it, give you feedback, um, start to do some testing, work out any kinks, um, see what features you should add on your roadmap, which ones you should cut. You're spending really longer than three months developing. Uh, you might be spending a lot of time designing and developing your app and a whole slew of features that might not be at all what the user's looking for. Maybe there really isn't a fit with your product. So trying to uh, narrow that down is really best practice practice, but to get a real estimate out of a company to design and develop your app, uh, there's a lot of uh, inputs that need to go in around sort of the technologies that are being used, your initial feature sets, etc.